गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट इन दिस लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू सी वॉट इज बायोडिग्रेडेशन ऑफ पेस्टिसाइड राइट वॉट इज पेस्टिसाइड सो दोज आर द केमिकल्स विच आर यूज फॉर डिफरेंट पर्पज फॉर एग्जाम्पल इट इज यूज फॉर हर्बिसाइड और विडिसाइड टू किल द वीड्स इट इज ऑल्सो यूज फॉर प्लांट ग्रोथ रेगुलेटर्स इट इज ऑल्सो यूज एज अ इंसेक्टिसाइड फंजीसाइड और रोडेंटिसाइड दैट्स मीन टू किल द पेस्ट and this is in crops as well as health care of human and animals so this is the positive aspect of this pesticide the, that is it is used for enhancing the crop or food productivity and to reduce the victim born disease so which is beneficial to human beings but the negative side of this pesticide usage is the pollution right so what happens as it is used as a herbicide to kill the weeds or weedicide so the in that way that will enter in the food chain from plant to so from soil to plant and plant to animal or in case of aquatic ecosystem as if it is uh, if it has enter into the water so that will absorb into the roots of phytoplankton then from phytoplankton it will comes to zooplankton and that will cause different uh, effect like carcinogenic the neurotoxic that will also affect the fertility and viability of the organism then second major is leaching of pesticide in water bodies suppose it is uh, the pesticide is introduced into the soil so in the rainy season from the soil it will be leached out into the water table so in this way this pesticide comes soil pollution plus water pollution and it is harmful to food chain there is one term that is bio magnification that can be asked for two marks that's mean the pesticide uh, or any pollutant that will enter in the tissues and will enter in the food chain from the organism or from the producer it can be get accumulated in the higher level of food chain that is bio magnification so then what are the different examples of pesticide so this is table with examples for example this is organochlorines which is soluble in lipids that will get accumulate in the fatty acids or fatty tissues of animals and in this way that will enter in the food chain that will toxic to animals if it is persistent long in the example examples of organochlorines is ddt then aldrin and myrex so you can see the effect of this pesticide for a, another example is organophosphate so which is organic solvent which can affect the central nervous system which are absorbed by plants and from plant it can be transferred to insect and the example is parathion methyl parathion so you can see the organo uh, phosphate or the pesticide its use plus its effect and its example so these are the some harmful effect of pesticide or this is the negative side of pesticide so there is need of biodegradation of this pesticide so that's why there is use of microorganism so what is the role of this microorganism so the microorganism can convert this toxic compound into less toxic and simple form so there is need to isolate such a microorganism which can degrade the pesticide and which can be isolated from contaminated site the site which is contaminated with pesticide 
you can take the help of this diagram then what are the examples of microorganism which are used to degrade the pesticide for example pseudomonas species which can degrade aerochlor 1 2 4 2 then there is second exam of fungi trichoderma viridi which has the ability to degrade endosulfan then aspergillus species like nigers terrus then along with iso sorry uh, aspergillus there is use of rhizopus so this all fungi has the ability to degrade metri pugin so this is one pesticide then along with uh, fungi and bacteria so there are some enzymes which are present in this microorganism that is that are also helpful to degrade the pesticide for example oxidoreductase which is present in pseudomonas and agrobacterium so which can degrade the glyphosate which is pesticide then another exam is uh, example is p450 so which is enzyme which is present in pseudomonas putida so in exam you should write the examples so this is about pesticide degradation thank you